What's going on everyone? So in this video we're going to take a look at installing the SD card on the Note 7 as well as the SIM card and transferring apps onto the SD card. So to do that we're going to need the SIM card or the SIM tray removal tool that came in the box which is this little key looking thing. And then of course our SIM card and our SD card. And you're going to want to do this with the phone powered off. The tray is at the top of the phone. There's a little spot for it right here and the tool goes right in that little spot and then pops it out. You slide this guy out and it has a space for micro SD card and the SIM card and they're both labeled as such. So putting them in is basically as easy as following the labels. And this is a blank SIM card. It's a dummy SIM card. The phone's not going to have service when I power it on. This is just for demonstration purposes. So they fit thusly. Micro SD card, SIM card over here. I'll go ahead and pop that into the phone. And again, you want to do this with the phone powered off. We'll slide those in. Make sure that's flush. And then go ahead and power your device on. Okay, once the device powers on, at least we get a message saying SD card, tap here to transfer media files. So go ahead and tap on that. Mm -hmm. So that's showing what's on the SD card and you can create folders and whatnot. But what we're really interested in doing here is moving actual apps over. Go ahead and go to the home screen. Okay, so once we're in the actual phone's home screen, we'll swipe down. And again, tapping on that takes you to the file manager. That's for files. What we want to do is move actual apps over. If I tap on apps, all the apps that I had downloaded to the phone when I did the restore in my previous video. So they're all on the phone now too. And that means we have a ton of apps. So to move the apps to the SD card, we'll go into settings. Then we go down to applications. And then here you start picking apps to move over. So Asphalt 8, storage, and then storage you use, you can do internal storage change and then you see you get the option for SD card and then it's going to tell you exporting it as well 8 and it's dated SD card take a few moments and then you just go ahead and hit move and then you see there we go it is moving the app to the SD card and so now we see it says storage use is external storage and well down here in the storage section we have total app and data so part of the app does still have to live on the phone that's basically what points to the SD card and says hey for this app go here on the SD card so the app still lives on your phone partially but now the majority of it will live on the SD card and you can just go through and keep doing that. At this point, most developers do support this. Every once in a while, you'll still find the occasional app that doesn't support it. So if you see the option is not enabled, then not your, your phone isn't broken or anything. It's just that the app isn't enabled, but most apps do support this nowadays. So definitely something worth looking into if you want to save storage. Uh, another thing you want to do, go ahead and go to the camera. And so here you see it says, an SD card has been inserted. The default storage location will be changed to the SD card. Single shots will be saved to SD card. And so again, the name of the game here is just freeing up internal memory. Many more videos coming on the Note 7 as well as other Android devices and other technology in general. So make sure you hit that subscribe button. If you have any questions, comments, or suggestions for me, you can find me on Facebook, Twitter, Google+, and Instagram. And I'll see you next time. Take care.